This is your three minute radiation fallout forecast for Friday, February 24th, 2012. In Canada, snow alerts have been issued for the following provinces BC, Alberta, Saskatchewan, Ontario, Quebec, New Brunswick, Newfoundland, Prince Edward Island, and Labrador. Moderate to heavy precipitation is forecasted for most of the southern provinces. Jet stream overlay will coincide with the west coast and the east coast all the way over to Ontario. Snow should be avoided if possible in these areas. A full list of alerts can be found on the weather network. In the U.S., current rain and snowfall along with jet stream overlay is occurring over a significant portion of the country this weekend. Southern coastal Alaska, the Pacific Northwest, Idaho and Montana have the highest potential for fallout as well as all states east of the Mississippi, including Nebraska. Please refer to IntelliCast radar and CRWS jet stream forecast to keep on top of this situation through the weekend. In Europe, the jet stream is currently centered over the UK down through Belgium, the Netherlands, Luxembourg, Germany, Austria, Hungary, Romania, and Bulgaria. Current radar and predicted rainfall for the next 72 hours, though, is very light. The highest potential for fallout would be in the UK, especially south of London. Nuke Report There's been multiple events at several nuclear plant sites that have occurred over the past 48 hours. Event number one, Brunswick in North Carolina experienced several reactor shutdowns over the past few days from cooling loss, grid failure, and transformer failures. Number two, Palo Verde in Arizona. A suspicious package was discovered on site. It was removed by the bomb squad and no further information is available at this time. Number three, McGuire in North Carolina also. There was an off-site notification to law enforcement that was made due to an individual making threats at the site. The report does not specify if this was an employee. Number four, Fort Calhoun, Nebraska. An oil leak was discovered from a gearbox in an intake structure. The state of Nebraska Department of Environmental Quality has been notified. Event number five, also at Fort Calhoun. It was discovered that 21 emergency sirens are not operational. Local law enforcement has been notified to perform compensatory measures in the event of an emergency. Please check the NRC event notification page for more details. Please visit FukushimaFacts.com for up-to-the-minute news on Fukushima and other nuclear news. This message has been brought to you by Radchik and the Orion Talk Radio Network. We care about you because your government doesn't. Stay safe.